This is BondBridge Pro. And this is an acoustically transparent movie screen custom crafted by Seymour Screen Excellence. It features the company's top tier in lighter Neo screen material, and it's trim frame with concealed motorized masking and an RF remote control. In just a minute, I'll show you how BondBridge Pro can turn this RF-based masking system into a Wi-Fi controlled smart home device. Welcome everyone, my name is Todd Anderson, editor at avnirvana.com, and today we're gonna to be taking a quick look at the power of BondBridge Pro. The original BondBridge, seen here to the left of the new BondBridge Pro, hit the market in 2018, with the Pro version arriving in 2020. Priced at $379, BondBridge Pro learns the commands of an appliance's RF remote control. This allows owners to control things like motorized shades, ceiling fans, and other RF equipped devices using the Bond Home app or voice control through Alexa, Google Assistant, Siri, and a host of other smart home platforms. This single unit can sit anywhere in a 3,500 square foot home it requires no additional wiring and can control up to 50 different RF controlled devices in your home, no matter where you are in the world. When I was first approached about reviewing BondBridge Pro, I quickly became aware that I have nothing in my home that requires RF control. My window shades are all manual. They're plantation shades made out of wood. I have a wood burning fireplace and all of our ceiling fans, they have you know, switches on the wall. But in a luck of good timing, it was around the same time I was receiving my Seymour Screen Excellence movie screen. At the time I ordered the screen, I was given a number of different control options and I chose the RF remote control. It's a simple system with controls for closing, opening, and stopping movement of the masking system. Integrating the screen's RF control with BondBridge Pro was a very simple process involving the use of the Bond Home app my original remote control in just a few minutes of my time. I did find one limitation and that is the stop feature on the masking system. Now the command does translate over to BondBridge Pro, but there's a little delay in giving the voice command and having it actually execute, which renders the stop feature kind of useless because that feature is used for varying aspect ratios that aren't exactly 16 by nine or 240 to one. So, I just had to revert to using my good old remote control for situations where I needed to stop the screen in between movements. Using BondBridge Pro, I've been able to control my screen's masking using both Google Assistant and Siri shortcuts on my iPhone. Let's go step into my theater room and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so here we are in the dark recesses of my home theater room. It's totally light controlled in here. So filming is a little bit hard, but I think you're gonna be able to see uh, what you need to see in terms of BondBridge Pro controlling the masking system on the screen. So first up, we have the Bond Home app, and I'm just gonna press a button here to ask it to close the masking. And there you can see it in operation. Uh, it moves fairly quickly from pressing the button to uh, executing the command. And now here is Google Assistant open masking. Sure, opening the masking. And you can see that command was executed fairly quickly uh, with almost no delay. And finally with Siri, hey Siri, close movie masking. Okay, sending, command sent. So just a slight delay over Google Assistant, but as you can see, it still operates. For more detail on BondBridge and BondBridge Pro, please come over to avnirvana.com and read my full written review. I'll put a link to that right down in the description below. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy content like this, hit like, subscribe, and then join the conversation on avnirvana.com.